so we've come along to a tailor gutter up here and they're on we're in the midday and we've seen some fish being landed up here closest sort of Indian head and there's another hook up there so we're going to get down and uh, get amongst it so here's my setup the Albi nearly a 14 foot rod and 65 Albi in this case here the 650 E5 like the rock series got um, 20 pound line and brace with the sinker running with the sinker running between two swivels about 60 70 centimeters and then only a shorter all right and there we go right, yep he's on a shorter trace there we go a shorter trace to the sinker of about 25 30 centimeters and that rig is based off uh, Mr. Alby, who is Australian surf casting champion. I'll bring this fish up the waves. There it goes a little chopper. But that's what we're here for. Midday. Look at all these four-wheel drives. People folks, there's enough casting distance here between people but this is what fishing brings to the economy and Craig's got one here too another chopper bring it up sideways in the wash and there's another fish in this gutter and there's another hook up down there it's all happening here now mate Matt's on over there another chopper and Craig's hooked up again are in close to shore how magic is this middle of the day okay right out and you can see this water here you can see that greener water in close greener water running along here ripley greener water moving water and waves breaking out the back cleaner water in close now the tides dropping so it might potentially not be enough water for the fish might move into that deep area a bit but we shall see oh and there's another hook up down there all right let's go again cast out wind up the slack so you've got a tight line on and then you're just starting this slow retrieve so your bait's moving slow retrieve Alright, and there we go, point, point. And on. On again. Oh yeah. Taylor action, middle of the day. Bring him up. I'll swing him into me. I'll either to swing him into your chest. I lose him, doesn't matter. Okay, get him up close enough. Look at this wave. Oh, I might land him while we're here. Look. There he is. There's another another chop. You can see here on these true turn hooks. Pick up very nicely. You see there those offset shanks. Great for hooking fish up. Those offset tanks and the swivel in between gives you nice big coverage of your filter get it back out get it out there I'll just cast I'll retrieve it up just to below the top swivel now and then just with the cast pulling down with the front arm and pushing with the back arm like that now because there's a bit of sweep to the to the left I'm casting a bit to the right take up that line quickly ready for that strike oh and on again Chris on the lures over there on the little rod ready for that rat that tat oh, oh yep on good fish good fish Yeah, this is a nice fish. Play him up the waves. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, there he is. Bring him up this way. There he comes. There we go. That's a better. That's a better fish. There's another hook up down there. The long rods. Just a legend of Fraser. Long rods. Halby reels. Taylor. Awesome, awesome fun. Four wheel drives, beach fishing, just love it, just match. Right, out there in that sudsy water. That just looks such good tailor water. You can see the suds, the white water in, over that green, darker water that's rolling in, rolling in, and breaking near us ashore. And you can see the movements of the, of the waves and the currents are sort of channeling out more sort of holes and stuff here so this gutter's changing ever so slightly continuously so, so retrieve sort of once i get out of that zone you sort of know okay you missed them you've got to get it again then what you can do too is look around if fish sort of go a few casts and they're not there it's best to move and you know, we're just keeping enough for um, for a feed and uh, let the rest go. Good fun. We haven't done a great deal of tailor fishing with this trip. We've concentrated on dew, uh, flathead, whiting, so it's good to really get more serious about the tailor. So, uh, mate Matto, the chef, with another chopper. Come down. And we're on again. And just got up a uh, rod. Fish up sideways. Me, I'll wait for this wave. Wait for the wave, bring him up. In the wash. There we go. Another chopper. So again, on the true turn hooks. And use about a nine sinker. This is a bit of a sweep, and that green bead stopped that sinker banging down on the knot to absorb the, the hits. So there we go. And mate, Gary, is on. Now we've our boat's just after one o'clock. Come on again. Oh, the jumping tailor. Jumping tailor, uh, gutter up, up around cathedral or so, a bit further. Oh, riding tailor. Good, good fun. Again, I might swing this fish up to my chest. Swing him over. And brother Ron's on in the middle. Cautiously land it up on the beach. Another chopper. So I'm just casting out here that slightly deeper water at the back. How much just in shallow? So I'm just lobbing it out. The back of that gutter, sand spit, letting it float down there. And there it's just floating across me. And just keeping that line tight, retrieving it slowly. That's a Bait's on the move with the bit of sweep. And as it picks up pace, I, I quicken the retrieve. Now it's sort of straight in front of me. I can slow that retrieve down. Oh, and there we go. Oh, chop, chop. Love the, the hits of the tailor. That rat attack. Rat attack means you strike and you strike firmly. None of this sort of waiting them from the take it like a whiting or sometimes a dew mouth in that bait. Carter, you want to hit that straight away. So again I'll swing it the fish into me, that's a slightly better fish. Oh this is a better fish. Bit of a run.
truck. And there he is. That's that's definitely a, a better tailor. Good one. And yeah, just hope you got something out of that in terms of reading that water. So there's a greener water, greener means deeper. Um, and just look the way the sort of water's uh, flowing. And in this case here, casting out to the deeper part of the gutter that's coming close and just letting it drift out for that. Good fun.